Boys and girls, I might have done something very stupid. I spent literally all my stubs on equipment. I decided I wanted to just be with one brand. I don't know why. I just thought this would be a good idea. We'll find out if it was. I don't know. But here we go, boys. I pretty much bought every single diamond under armor equipment. We have the cleats. These things give you 11 speed, 7 ceiling, 8 reaction, 10 home runs, and ten or 6 hits per 9. We have the glove, which just makes you extremely good at fielding. We got the batting gloves. We have the under armor batting sleeve. We have literally everything under armor as possible. I mean, they don't have under armor skins. I don't think they have an elbow guard. I didn't see it at least. And then they have some under armor like, uh, like helmets and stuff, but we're not a catcher, so it literally doesn't matter so i pretty much spent a hundred thousand stubs on gloves batting gloves and cleats i don't know if that's smart and the slate yeah i don't know if this is a good idea but we're gonna find out today so i am now officially an under armor baseball player absolutely freaking insane we're gonna hop into our next game here it's a three game series against the cubs and i really hope that this actually helps me out because usually when i uh when i use new equipment like for example when i use the bryce harper cleats uh or the bryce harper batting gloves i did horrible like i didn't do good at all and the same kind of thing with the bat i did the barry bonds bat and did horrible so this could be a really really bad episode boys like this could be absolutely trash especially since we're debuting three new equipment items i don't know because we've used the batting gloves before but we have not used the sleeve the uh the cleats or the fielding glove i don't know I don't know what to expect here. But yeah, we are 58 and 52. The Cubs, uh, I think, are leading our division, right? Or was it the Red? Dude, I, I never can remember this. I honestly never remember, but the Cubs are absolutely killing it. They're 63 and 45. They are absolutely insane. So we gotta make sure we sweep these bums and get ahead of the uh and get ahead in our division because bro it's bad and yeah if you missed the last episode we were actually leading the division leading the world in home runs this year we beat barry bonds last episode we are at 76 home runs and that's a good start don't catch that is that out oh my god i thought it was gonna be a bump wait why is this guy bro you didn't think that was down dude are you freaking insane who's this runner at third base you're a freaking idiot dude that thing was so clearly down. You could have scored. You just screwed me in RBI. Are you kidding me? Oh, whatever. All right, Mighty Goat's up again. Mighty Goat is up again. Dude, I kind of want to change the uh, the arm sleeve to, like, bright red. Kind of like everything else on my body, like the batting gloves. Yeah, we need to make that sleeve bright red. Oh, good hit, baby. Uh, should we stay? Yeah, let's just stay. Boys, we can actually hit the cycle here. We have to double in the single pretty quickly. It's only the third inning. We need to hit this triple. The triple is probably the hardest one to get, obviously. Home runs are easy. I mean, I've hit 76 of those bad boys already. But if, can we hit that triple? That is a real question. I think we've only had, like, one career triple. Maybe two. Oh, right to me. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Okay, right on it. Right on it. Stick it. Stick it. Stick it. Stick it. That a baby. All right. But, yeah, now I think we're going to get it at bat. And if we hit a triple, bro, I am going to actually cry here. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Batting 390, dude. Yeah, ever since we... Um, yeah, let's hit a double or better. But ever since we beat Barry Bonds, dude, we've been killing it. I don't even know if we've gotten out since we beat Barry Bonds. Like, we have just been absolutely destroying the baseball. Good take. I, I'm laying off that crap. This guy just pitching me like... What, what, what do you think? I'm going to swing at a curveball below the dirt? Or below the zone? I'm the best player ever, bro. Oh, no. Oh, no. Dang it, we got out. Literally right as I start saying something pop Wait, the Cubs came back. Are you kidding me, bro? Brewers, figure it out, dude. What are you doing? Pitchers, all you got to do is just get people out. That's it. I know it's easier said than done. But, bro, Mighty Go can't do it all, okay? I'm not going to be surprised if the Brewers coaching staff comes to me and says, Mighty Go, listen. Listen, bro, you're way better than everyone else on our team. You honestly are our team. Can you please pitch? And I'm going to have to say, okay. I'll pitch. I will pitch for you guys. But look at this. We got a big situation here. I guarantee you we go yeah yeah right here and hit an absolute tater to left center field. Whoa, way outside. I didn't swing it at that. But yeah, man. It's literally when Mighty Goat does good. Look at, the, look at the attendance, bro. Ever since the GOAT has beat Barry Boz, the attendance numbers have been ridiculous. I don't think the MLB is paying me enough. God dang it. I mean, like before, dude, we were getting like at, at like Oakland. We played the athletics. We had like 7,000 people watching or maybe like 13,000. I don't know. But ever since Mighty Goat, that's crushed. Oh, my God. Dude, that thing was absolutely destroyed. What do you know? Mighty Goat just clutch again. There you go, baby. Oh, are you sad, pitcher? Are you sad you just ruined the game for your team? Are you sad? Yeah, man. Ever since Mighty Goat beat Barry Bonds. Oh, my God. Look what I mean, bro. Look at this. Wait, this is... Oh! Oh! 
two God dang it. Well, we lose. We lose. 100%. And with first base open, Here it goes. Go yeah, I'm mad, I'm mad too, Mighty. I'm mad too. And Mighty was removed for a pinch runner, runner in the ninth, run. and we lost. Are you freaking kidding me? Brewers! What are you doing? Oh my god, dude. Alright, I'm gonna go change my equipment real quick. Alright, so yeah, I managed to uh, change all my stuff to the actual colors it is. The fielding glove, a little weird. I wish it just came like how it normally is. Like, if you choose the Under Armour glove, that's literally the glove you have on your hand. Not like a custom-made freaking blue one, whatever you had before. I really wish you just changed the colors, but hey, that's just me, whatever. But we did get the arm sleeve looking freaking saucy, and it actually looks pretty legit. Uh, it took me a minute to figure out, but I figured it out, and we're, we're really smart, okay? But yeah, we gotta beat the Cubs, dude. The Cubs are disgusting, and the Brewers suck. They completely screwed me last game, but look at that arm sleeve. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. It took a little second to render in all the way. I was just saying, it looks a little different, but that thing looks insane, and... Oh my god, Mighty. Come on, buddy. What are you freaking doing? What are you freaking doing, dude? But yeah, man. The Brewers are really screwing me right now. If somehow we don't win a World Series this year, especially after Mighty Goat hits 100... He's probably going to hit 120 home runs this year. If the team does not win with a player that hit 120 home runs, they are not the team for me. So you best believe... If we don't win a World Series this year with the Brewers, we will definitely be requesting a trade. Wow, that was a terrible pitch to swing at. But we will definitely be requesting a trade to get the F out of here. We might even go join the Cubs. I think I'm going to join the best team out there. I mean, like, literally, I played with the Red Sox, who were absolute trash. Absolute trash in this game. And uh, the Brewers, I thought, were going to be a big step in the right direction. And I'm starting to think they're not. I'm literally starting to think they're not. But let's see here. Let's drive it a run here. Screw the advance runner crap. Let's score a runner. All right, so we're at, we're actually winning, but it is only the third inning. Anything can happen, especially on the Brewers. But I'm not going to be surprised if our next at bat we're down like 13 runs. Maybe. Booyah, baby. We're on this way. We are on our way to 100, baby. Our 100th career home run, or our 100th seasonal home run is going to be a big deal. That is a big milestone. I think we just recently hit our 200th overall, but we are 22 home runs off from 100 in one season. I need to look at like all the records, like the total bases, the uh, the like amount of RBIs. Like I don't know the uh, the records for all those. Um, I only know the home run one, which is ours now at 77 or 78 home runs, which is absolutely insane, completely unrealistic. Like there's no way in the actual MLB someone will ever hit 76 home runs in one season or 78 I guess I don't think unless they're just taking steroids out the butt you know but who knows let's hit another bomb here oh maybe maybe I thought we hit that one way better than we actually did was that out oh my god I did I did not think that was a home run wow mighty you are an absolute animal dude good god Wow, yeah, I did not think that ball was going to go out. I feel like we barely hit that one. But that is our second bomb of the game. I'm pretty sure we have, like, all our RBIs. Like, we at least have four of them, right? I'm not surprised, though. Literally, literally, Mighty Goat deserves... Like, I think this is the end of his contract, right? Um, so, he should be signing for at least $25 million. If he gets less than $25 million a year, dude, I'm going to be ticked. Like, I'm going to be absolutely ticked. But here we go. Bottom of the fifth inning. Still 6-0 the, to the Brewers. We're absolutely killing it. Oh, that's me. Oh, that's me. Oh, wait, we might actually make dive. No! Ah, oh, man. I mean, we've only made one diving play in our career, and it wasn't, like, amazing. I mean, it was still a sick play, but I want a full extension layout grab. Who's that guy? Who the F's that guy? Yeah, Mighty Go. How many RBIs did it say he had? Uh, I don't even know. I didn't really. I was not paying attention. I think he's got four, dude, because he's got two home runs. He could have five, though. He, could, he might have five RBIs. I have no freaking clue. But let's go. Wait, what is that? Three run and a... Wait, he might have two three run home runs. So he literally could have all of our RBIs. Please carry. Get out. Get over set screen, right fielder. Oh! Dang it, dude. There was one game before where Mighty Go hit three three run home run games. Or he had three three home runs. My God, three run... Three, three run home runs in one game. And I want to hit four. That would be insane. 12 RBIs on four home runs would be absolutely insane. That's got to be an MLB record. I mean, the record for home runs in a game is four, right? So, yeah, that would definitely be a record if all four were three run bombs. That would be absolutely freaking ridiculous. And here we go. Another. Oh, we only have five RBIs. Dang it. Well, oh, my God. 
Dude, we almost had a chance, dude. If we would hit that last ball out, dude, you know how many home or how many RBIs we'd have this game? Oh. It was right down the freaking pipe. What am I doing? Mighty, what are you freaking doing, dude? Come on, man. Come on, man. It's just hits this ball four. What am I doing? Literally, what is wrong with me? Good take. All right, so two on. No outs. 30,000. There's actually significantly less people here this game than the last game. I don't know why. I literally have no clue why. Maybe it's like a different day of the week. But God dang it, dude. We missed that one, too. All right, whatever. It's the top of the eighth. We're up six runs. That should be enough for the Brewers to secure this dub. I won't be surprised, though. The Brewers are kind of trash. They tend to uh, blow a lot of leads. And we get another RBI or another at bat. Wow, dude. Literally, we're two for five. We could have hit six home runs this game if I wasn't a freaking idiot. God dang it, dude. I never, ever get six at bats in a game. And of course, the time I do, I suck. Like, two for five is not going to cut it. Our batting average has dropped. I'm sad. I'm sad. If I get this hit, we're going to be at 500, which is good. But two for five right now is not cutting it. Let's hit a bomb. And a base hit. Who likes base hits? No one. Oh, God, you're toasted. No, he's not. He's safe. All right, well, another RBI for the GOAT. I wonder how many that is on the career or on the uh, on the season. That's got to be almost 200, bro. That literally might be 200 dongs or 200 RBIs. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't even know how to view that. I don't. I literally don't know how to view that. But that was an incredible game. Let's go play one more. All right, so yeah, here it is. So far, we have split with the with the Cubs. Um, I really want to win this series because two and one is way better than one and two. And like I said, bro, the Brewers are barely there, bro. Like they are like five games back in first place. They're barely winning the wild card. So if we don't win, if we don't win this series going two and one, bro, that is going to be bad for us in the long run. So we got to make sure we freaking win this game. And look at that. His last 10 games, 23 for 40. That's actually not as good as I thought it would have been. I, I really thought Mighty Goat was actually killing it. He's actually slowed down quite a bit. What the F? I mean, no, I mean, trust me, 25 for 40 or whatever that was is absolutely insane. But I want to go 39 for 40. God dang it, dude, as we got into a double play. I feel like these cleats and these gloves and this arm sleeve has done nothing but hurt us. We might need to sell all this stuff and get Nike or, uh, or freaking Adidas or something. You guys got to let me know. What company you guys think Mighty Ghost should sign with? Do you think we should stay with Under Armour? Do you think we should go to Evo Shield? Do you think we should go to freaking Nike? I think I just said that. But you guys got to let me know who we should go to. That ball is ripped, though. Yeah, that ball was absolutely smashed. But yeah, any company you want, let me know in the comment section below. I really wish they had, uh, well, I guess they do have Marucci. I kind of like Marucci. I think I might go with Marucci. I don't know. I don't know. You just guys, you just got, you guys just gotta let me know, okay? Here we go. One for two on the day. The Cubs are absolutely waxing us, dude. Oh my God. Four to zero. What are we doing, Brewers? Freaking kidding me, dude. Oh my. That was a terrible pitch to swing out. But yeah, dude. I don't get it, bro. The Brewers suck. Literally, if Mighty Goat's not hitting eight home runs, getting seven RBIs a game, literally, we lose. It makes no sense could take. But yeah, you guys gotta let me know what team we should go do to after this season. But I'm telling you, if the Brewers win, I might, I might stay with them to give them, uh, to give them a couple more, uh, a couple more wins, you know, because literally, any team Mighty Goat's on, their, like, win rate increases by, like, 2,000%. Like, literally, any team with Mighty Go, like, if Mighty Go was not on the Brewers, they would probably be in dead last, like, dead last. But since they got Daddy on the team, they actually have a chance. Hey, we at least scored one run. Mighty Go's literally not doing anything this game. I mean, at least we got a hit. Our hit streak is still alive. There you go. Good hit. Good hit. Only singles this game. This might be the first episode ever where we don't actually hit a homer. Oh, crap. Okay, well. I don't know what just happened right there, but we didn't get out. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, that was almost bad. I'm not going to lie. And we get another at-bat. All right, are the Brewers coming back? Oh, my God. Okay. Two on. Two outs in the top of the ninth. This is literally... I'm literally showing the Brewers how much my net worth is. They are down three runs. Literally game over, but I get a shot to tie this thing. We're probably going to do it. Watch this. If this guy gives me a fastball up and in, it's a freaking tie game. And then the Brewers can go blow it in the bottom of the ninth. Come on, baby. Do not line out. Hit a bomb. Hit a bomb. Are you kidding me? No! Oh my god, no. Mighty go. We lost batting clutch too. I barely missed it. No! Oh my god, that sucks, dude. I thought... Oh my god, dude. I literally, I literally thought that was my time to shine. But I freaking choked. God dang it, dude. Well, Mighty Goats 2 for 5 was not good enough. We didn't get any RBIs. I can't even blame myself, dude. I mean, the Brewers, that's completely the Brewers' fault. The Brewers' pitching staff gives up more freaking runs 
than I do in Battle Royale. And that's a lot, dude. So, yeah, that sucks. That sucks. But I guess let's see where we stand in the league leaders or in the standings, whatever. It's not, it's not going to be good, boys. Yeah, the Cubs. We are we are now freaking seven back to the Cubs because we lost two. If we would have swept there, I think we would have been within three games, which would have been absolutely insane. Where are we at in the wild card here? Uh, so we're one back in the wild card. I mean, hey, we've only played, what is that, 113 games, I think. Yeah, 113 games. So we still have plenty of time left. I mean, there's six, 162 games in a season. So, uh, we still got like 50 games or whatever. So, uh, yeah, we got plenty of time to catch up. It's going to be tough because literally in the last like 20 games, we have not like literally gained any ground. So, this is kind of scary. But, boys, that is going to end this video. Let me know in the comment section below what company you want me to sign with Nike. If you want me to stay with Under Armour, Adidas, I don't freaking care. Let me know in the comment section below. But I'm out of here. I'll see you next time. Oh, peace. I